riding on Chiron. Give me tunnel. <laughs> They're clearing the freeway. There's nobody else driving on it. What? You're kidding. We've got to cut to OJ. I can't. It's the NBA Finals. You do realize how much these spots are going for. Put the game in the box. What? No! You have to think clearly. OJ is news, entertainment, and sports. Jim, I can't. I, in 24 years, I've never done anything like this. OJ gets the big screen. I'm calling upstairs. Shit. Asshole. Go. Ready two and take two. Ready up, Link? Maybe for a Sir? Sir, are, are you sure I can't call you a cab or? No, you're gracious and kind. Domo arigato. You're welcome. Can I? Just let her go, please. Since when do you ask politely? A lot of people are gonna die if we don't stop this. Are you a shapeshifter? Is that Dudley do right in there? You can't hold us here forever. I don't plan on it. Just long enough for Samuel to finish the show. Isn't that right, Em? Oh, I don't think she heard me. Are you okay? Oh, Siler, please, listen to me. Please, Samuel made me do it. Really? Because I thought you were the puppet master. Oh, come on. What do you care about this girl anyway? I'm Dr. Daniel Pierce. I know exactly who you are. I'm just a little unclear as to what the FBI's pet shrink is doing at the public defender's office. Your client is acutely mentally ill. Until he gets a court-ordered forensic mental health exam, he's sane in the eyes of the law. I've made a request of the judge to have a psychiatrist appointed. I'll do it. You'll do what? Evaluate Brady, testify on his behalf. I'm sure you're qualified, but there's a slight conflict of interest. You're still on the FBI's payroll. I told them Brady didn't do it. They ignored my expert opinion. Now I'm offering it to you, free of charge. FBI's own expert testifying against them? Huh. I mean, that's the kind of fireworks I would love to set off a trial. It may not be a trial. If I certify that Brady was too ill to understand his rights, you might get the confession thrown out. How soon can you see him? Journalist, huh? Yeah, we're doing a story on more protocols from intake to autopsy. Too bad. I was hoping you'd be kin. This one's got unclaimed written all over it. What makes you say that? Uh, you know, you get a feel for these things. I mean, you know, the body's been here for eight hours. We still don't have a positive ID. Why'd you pick this guy anyway? A friend of mine at LAPD thought it'd be an interesting case. Huh. Well, everybody tells a story, right? 2013, 10, 26. Here's your guy. without any further ado, the birthday boy, the love of my young life, my one and only son that I know of anyway, Lars with you, Doyle. Thanks everybody for being here on my special night. You know, a man's 40th birthday is a once in a lifetime deal. No matter how old you actually are when it happens. Let it go. <laughs> the way I look at it, I'm that much closer to being legally qualified to take advantage of the senior saver menu at Lenny's Deli. Huh? <laughs> Sir, are you aware you crossed the double yellow line back there? Please, officer. This is unnecessary. You should go. Have you been drinking? No, not at all. Sir, I'm going to need you to step out of the vehicle. Officer, I'm really sorry about this. Sir. Hey, hey, don't. Son of a...